Ease of use is what everybody is looking for, you know, it's the first thing they ask for. I actually do feel that it's a lot more important than uh, here in New Zealand than elsewhere in the world. Staff who are working in ERP solutions here tend to do a, a large range of different types of functions. Um, therefore, they might be doing um, accounts receivable today, they might be doing accounts payable tomorrow, they might be doing invoicing the day after that. They have to learn a lot more. Ease of use is therefore a lot more important because they don't have to learn things by rote. Consider purchasing a car. My neighbour has just purchased a Lamborghini and he thinks it's fantastic. It goes to 0 to 100 in a blink of an eye. It'll do a thousand miles an hour. It has an exhaust throb that spine tickling. So I purchased the Lamborghini. Unfortunately, the experience wasn't that great for myself because I've got five children. I have a llama, a sheep and three dogs. It, it wasn't appropriate. It needs to be fit for purpose in terms of what you actually want to do. So, what can you do about this? You can modify your car so that it'll accommodate more people. You can put a tow bar on it so it can pull your llama around your sheep and your cat. That is not a great way of going about it. You should have purchased the right car in the first place. Yeah, I should have purchased the Range Rover, but I didn't. So I'm now basically stuck with a modified Lamborghini. Very expensive. This is a very similar process that a lot of manufacturers actually go through. Everybody asks about total cost of ownership. It's like this first or second question that people ask about. Total on, on, cost of ownership is only half of the equation, of course. You know, it, the costs have to be equated to benefits. Um, you can put in a very basic manufacturing solution, let's say it costs you a dollar. If the long-term benefit from that is, is only 50 cents, you don't want to do it. Similarly, you, you can buy a sophisticated solution, costs you a million dollars, if the return on the investment is one and a half million dollars, then go ahead and do it. So